Hey guys, this is just me venting a little, and since I'm home alone and there's no one here to listen to me, I thought I'd put it out there on video. Some of you know that I've been going through the process of becoming a licensed foster care parent, and I've been spending the weekend going through the fast track is what they call it since they're in such desperate need of foster parents in my area. I live in a small town. There's only two foster families here in the small town and they had as many as 50 children that had to be shipped 64 miles away into foster care because there's no families here. I'm already a single mom I have two children, and I'm really bad at a lot, <laughs> but I think I'm a pretty damn good mom, and this is something that I really wanted to do. I have a personal reason for wanting to help abuse children, and it's a lot of training, and it's going to be an emotional journey, but I really think that... I can probably impact a child's life in a positive way. Anyway, when I was at this training yesterday, we had to go through this exercise to show you that there's all kinds of children in foster care. There's not, you know, one particular color child not one particular nationality. There's just, you know, a child's a child. And no child should be abused. Anyway, while I'm sitting there, this lady in front of me, who is Hispanic, she made the comment, well, what if I get a child that I can't understand? Now, she's making this comment in very broken English. And as we're sitting there going through this training, she's not filling out any paperwork. She's not, you know, doing what she's supposed to be doing. She's just kind of sitting there days and off. She keeps turning around asking, how long is this training supposed to be? And she's really annoying the crap out of me because I'm not patient with people like that anyway. Maybe I shouldn't be a foster parent. I don't know. But <clears throat> I get very impatient with adults that are stupid, basically. There's no other word for it. So I don't see color, but I do see stupid. And it comes in all shapes and sizes and colors. Anyway, this lady made the comment, what if she gets a child who doesn't speak Spanish and she can't understand them? And the caseworker says, well, you know, we're not going to place that child with you, you know. And she's like, well, shame on the parents for not teaching the children um, Spanish. Every child should be bilingual. Every household should be bilingual. That's the kind of, you know, that's the way America's turning. And it was everything in my power to bite my tongue and remind myself that I'm a Christian and not reach up and just smack the crap out of the back of this lady's head. I live in America. You know, you should speak English. I shouldn't have to press one when I make a friggin' phone call to be able to speak to somebody in English. And then when I do get somebody on the phone that speaks English, I still can't understand them. I don't even know what the hell they're speaking. It ain't English. It, it's amazing to me the mentality that this, this lady had. You know, every child needs to speak, you know, more than one language and English you know how dare that be their first language I thought I still lived in America I mean it really irks me when I go to the grocery store and I'm seeing things written in Spanish and you know I gotta look halfway down the product to find you know directions in English it just really makes me angry